basically our strategy tonight is to just uh, we're doing a little bit of road cruising uh, and then we're also just pulling over whenever we see some like good badger holes and stuff like that and we're just walking along through the ditches here hoping to find uh, some smooth green snakes and hopefully a hog nose so those are our main targets right now and yeah we're just sort of walking along here seeing what we can stir up in the grass and checking around the those uh, those holes for snakes all right here it is our lifer smooth green snake in manitoba we are stoked right now like this is a huge highlight to say the least to find a smooth green snake so it's hard to express how excited i am i just think the fact that we have green snakes like this in canada is incredible we do not have these in bc so to find one it's our first night here we got our friend with us too he he spotted it in the grass and we weren't sure if we were going to see anything so yeah i'm just so stoked to find this little smooth green She's got eggs in her, we think, pretty sure. Just beautiful, not like hardly a blemish. And just being super calm and good for us as we enjoy, enjoy this really, really cool snake. All right, here's another smooth green snake just hanging out in the long grass here. You can see that green camouflage, but in the sunlight, it just shines. So we're gonna try and catch him. That's number two already though. This is unbelievable so far. Right, it's just right down in here. Oh, I got him. Beautiful. Just a car going by. Check that out, number two on the night. I think it's about the same size as the first one. Awesome. Two for two on the night. That's so cool. All right, so just like that, two smooth greens, a lifer for each of us. Uh, we couldn't be more stoked right now. This is pretty unbelievable. Um, these snakes are gorgeous. They remind us kind of like little miniature versions of the yellow-bellied racers that we find at home. Um, but this bright green is just way too cool to find in a snake. So, yeah, we're pretty stoked right now. Oh, there's skink. Jeez, oh, I missed him. There you go. Did he get out? I haven't seen him yet. He's gonna use it. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Where did you go? I think we got him. Hold on. Hold on. I can feel something wiggling. No. Jeez. I didn't even look for cactus. Yeah, yeah look at that. Smooth green snake number three for the trip. We'll set her back underneath her board where we found her. Oh, under your board. That's not under your board, that's the wrong one. Wait. All right, I just finally got my hands on this prairie skink. He was under a board and escaped, and then we checked the board again and he escaped again, and I chased him around in the bushes for probably five minutes. Finally caught him. He's still got his tail, fortunately. They'll detach these if you grab them, so I'm trying to hold him very gently. He chomped me, but that's okay. These are pretty cool. They're not a snake, but we still like seeing them, and they're, yeah, they're pretty neat little, little things, and they have a funny name. Who doesn't love saying the word skink? Alright, as usual, we're going to put this guy right back where we found him. This is his board. Go right in there. Yeah. 
Smooth green number four. Let's go. This looks like another female with eggs in her, just based on how fat she is towards the end here. Yeah, another successful trip out tonight. Fourth smooth green snake of the trip. This is awesome. So, this happened very quickly, but we just found three smooth greens in a matter of like two minutes. So, we got a little handful of smooth greens. This is so cool. I love these little snakes. Well, three just became five really, really fast, and we're still looking. So this has been uh, unbelievable, and they're they're uh, not they're not lifers anymore. Let's put it that way. Yeah, we're at a loss for words here. This is fantastic. Like, look at this little handful of snakes, and they all kind of have a little bit of different color variation on them too. Some are darker, some are a little lighter. Most of them seem to be pregnant females, just because they look like they've got eggs towards the back, but. This one lime green one is quite feisty. He tried to bite a couple times when we picked him up, so pretty sweet. All right, well, we've got five in hand. I saw six and seven. They both got away, but we're gonna let these guys go, and we still would really like to find a hog nose, so hopefully we can get one of those too. Here they go. Thanks for the fun evening. Red belly snake. Well, we are now in Saskatchewan and we are visiting uh, relative, uh, relatives of ours that have a farm. And right under this log is a red bellied snake, which is a, oh, he's starting to squirm now. Uh, it's a species we don't see in BC, so pretty cool. They're quite tiny. I'll try and get his red belly for us to see here. See that? They're really cool, a very silver, almost like a slate, and then red on the belly. 